Hey, just had a really fascinating afternoon hanging out with some Thunderbird pilots here at the show at Mather, California. Got some real detailed information. The main motto that the Thunderbirds fly by is a thing called Blind Trust. Is that what it's called? That's correct. Blind Trust. So they are trusting in the blind trust of their team in order to do the mission of putting on one of these shows. For example, pre-flights. The pilots do no pre-flight activities on the aircraft. There's no pre-flighting of the jet. It's all relied upon by the crew chiefs and the other members of the team to have the jet ready to go. So by the time the uh, show starts, they'll be standing at attention here at the back of their jet. The music starts on cue. Everything is choreographed to the letter, and they, um, on cue, walk around to the front of the jet and then get their suit on and then on cue, climb into the jet, pop the canopies. And the whole show starts <clears throat> on time, and their heads are locked, just locked forward. The aircraft is already all set up with all, all the frequencies and all the adjustments and trim settings that it needs to put on the show. Once they're doing the show, they're flying the jet with full nose down full trim, nose correct? Down full nose down trim, except for one maneuver. So they're holding 40 to 50 pounds of pressure the entire time. Well, back stick pressure, even though it's a fly-by-wire jet in the F-16s, they get used to that stick pressure. But there's one maneuver where they got to um, uh, neutralize the trim, and that's the maneuver I always thought was the hardest looking one of all. Sure enough, it, the pilot said it's their, the one they don't like the most, or the least like maneuver, is that aileron roll where they all spread out a little bit and do an aileron roll right simultaneously. Yep. So they gotta neutralize the trim for that, do that aileron roll, and then put that full nose down trim back in. And every single maneuver is done to a very strict script, and it, this script is down by lead. He does it down to the um, syllabus of the words, right? Yeah, the, yeah, the syllables. The syllables of the of the words. Ready, set, roll, now. Maybe it's on the end of now, for example, a rather poor example, but it's just an incredible bit of teamwork. And then the diamond review, right? The diamond yeah. review gets the tightest formation of wing overlap on the F-16s. So what are they looking at, Kellen, on the Diamond Review? So on the Diamond Review, once uh, we got the briefing from number two, so he was saying that in his position, once they uh, pull underneath the jet, um, you can see these knuckles right in here. One, two, three. That he's lining up right here. He's uh, this far back, right underneath the wing, uh, the trailing edge, 18 inches down. And we'll show you the picture of him crouch there in the, the proper spot uh, and that's the top of his canopy 18 inches from the wing so it's a vertical 18 inches and he's staring at these knuckles and so that's a lot of wing overlap and his wing tips are just clearing everything else and of course on the f-16 everything in the f-16 is mounted well behind of the canopy so that's just some of the incredible things that they got to do to put on a show the life span of being a Thunderbird pilot is two years, maybe three. If you come in as the lead, what do they call it, the, the narrator, the guy who comes into the air show first and sets up the air show, the lead guy, that would be a three-year um, term as a lead, as a uh, Thunderbird pilot. Most Thunderbirds are a Thunderbird for only two years. And they're all on loan from the various commands, and of course it's very competitive. Uh, thing to get into uh, application process. You don't you, you don't get told you're a Thunderbird. You want it, you got to be there. You just yeah. gotta want to be there. And your first ride is the most humbling ride there ever is. It's just so incredibly difficult to do, and uh, these young kids do a great job of it. And they are young. It's a young man's sport. Kind of like something for you, Kellen. Yeah, I don't know about that. <laughs> Thanks so much for your support. We'll see you here. Come see the show.